Hi, my name is Martin, and in this video, I'd like to show you how to make an operator interface for your Arduino using a regular PC and USB cable. This is very convenient since you don't need to get any external device, do uh, difficult wiring, and also what's inter interesting, it gives you all the capacity of your computer screen. I searched quite a lot on the internet trying to find something that could allow me to read and write on the Arduino board that was quite inexpensive and that was not much too complicated to implement. So I found in Meginu Link software what I was looking for. It's about 40 bucks and their website are giving complete examples on how to use it, how to read and write on Arduino board. So here I can see programming line that goes in the Arduino so it can read and write through the Meguno Link interface software. Let's see now a first application. So here we have an application which controls a LED, the amount of time it's on and off. Actually, it's the LED 13, the one which is the internal LED of the board. So now it's on for about one second and off for about one and half a, and half a second. So now let's see the interface panel which is controlling it. This interface panel is one of the examples you can find on the web, website, Meguno website. So, here let's say I'm going to change the, uh, the on time for 10 seconds. This will make it blink quite faster. So I press set to send information and now let's have a look to the result. So we can see now it's on quite a short time and linking quite faster. So what's interesting in this example is that you can see um, you have set up some sort of a push button that sends information to the Arduino. And that's very interesting because if you don't have it, you will probably need some sort of hardware push button like this one which are actually toggle, but that's okay. And all the wiring that also take you more, take you entries, output inputs of the Arduino. So this is very practical. Now let's see a second example uh, where I'm showing you an interface panel, which I've done and which are showing the level of the light three photo cell are getting from their environment. We also have three controller which enable us to set the level of the light necessary to have a LED light or not. So when I say I put the level necessary to light the LED to one two hundred and a half more lights when the LEDs light on. So let's see what we got here. So we have the LED, the white LED light on because it has enough lights to make it on. Now Another thing which is interested in this interface panel and in which I have draw is a picture here. We have three pictures on the right side and those three pictures are showing the state of the lead. I remove this one so we can see it better. So now it's the lead, the blue lead which is on and now it's a quite simple pictures, but 
you could do everything else. And this is quite powerful. Instead of a just a blue square, you could have like a drawing showing a lever pushing a box. And when this lever is not working, you could have a, in the background the lever which is withdraw and not point, not uh, pushing the box. So that can allow you to make a very interesting animation with your uh, interface panel. Finally, let's look at the uh, programming parts um, in the Arduino. So in this case, we have, let's say, the interface panel, which is reading information, but the Arduino, which is sending the information. So the Arduino is writing. So here's the, here's the uh, two lines, programming line necessary to have the Arduino writing to the interface. And a bit further, we have the, uh, the program necessary to have it send the information we want. So it's right here. So it send the information to progress one, progress two, and progress three. Those are the name of the progress bar. And check check B1, check B2, check B3, the name of the box, of the checkbox. And a bit further, insert in the programming, in the software programming, the uh, pictures controller, picture command. So show control and hide control. So that gives you an example. So that's about it, and I hope you find it interesting in that uh, such an interface like a Meguno interface panel help you to design, to make, to to improve your project with Arduino. Thank you. Have a nice day.